What's your story? What's your sign? It's like we're twin flames in a different life Deep connection, lights a spark It's like you know me in the depths of my heart We're dreamers What's your type? Somehow I wanna know all about you Deep connection, lights a spark You already know me when we dance in the dark Hi friends, congratulations on choosing this 7 day weight loss aqua challenge. I am proud and super excited for you. If you stick to the plan, you will be losing 2 pounds per week. Ah! You will be 8 pounds lighter next month same day, 24 pounds less in 3 months. And you want to know what is the best of all? You will be enjoying a healthy weight loss. Yes body fat loss to be precise to get long-lasting results without so-called yo-yo effect just stay consistent do your best eat healthy be in the best shape of your new life soon now do the work no one will do it for you it may not be easy but it will be so worth it i promise i've done all that's in my power to make this journey fun and splashy now let's begin. You know what, friends? Even if you've been doing aqua for years, I bet you're gonna learn something new today because my head is spinning for new ideas. Are we ready? Yes, let's begin. Who I do suggest you are wearing aqua shoes for this particular workout. There is a little bit of sprinting, jumping, bouncing, and if you want to protect your feet, good idea to get something fancy for this one. Other than this, no equipment needed. And water level, anywhere around chest is perfect. Five minutes, warm up those muscles with aqua jogging, curling those knees up and down, rolling our feet, so heel is touching the bottom of the pool. Move your arms out and in, front and back, however you want to. Put a big smile on your face. Pull that belly in. Shoulders back and away from ears. Looking good, my friends. And let's jog. I'm going to show you different options for those arm moves. As you know, you can splash it. You can circle those wrists around. I love actually this because this is warming up those muscles that are so useful right there are tiny muscles on our wrists and yes we're gonna take care of those as well it's day one of our challenge how we feeling guys if you work out in a big group say i am fine and i'm ready if you work out alone do the same thing just twice as loud so your neighbors can hear you maybe they'll join you okay i'm alone today but I feel that we are doing this together. Keep on jogging. Keep pushing the water gently forward and backwards. And now moving on to the next exercise, jumping jacks, aqua jacks to be exact. 
open up your legs, jump out, close your feet, jump in. Yes, we can bounce a little bit up and down. It is warm up. We want to get those knees, those feet, entire body ready for a little bit more. Jump out and in. And let's make sure we still have that smile on our face. If you work out with someone, take a look if your partner is smiling. If not, say, hey, what's happening? What's going on? <laughs> smiling and laughing is burning calories as well. So why not? I love jumping jacks. It's fun and it's even more fun once we are turning around with those. Yeah, stay on your spot. Just spin around. Love it. Don't like those knees. Keep them slightly bent at all time. Allow your body to deal a little bit with that impact, guys. We are so light in the water. Can you feel it? We're going to be even lighter soon, huh-huh? All right. And now we have plie position. Let's move those arms out and in and pals down and up. Kind of like you were squatting on land. Then you're going to resume your jack jacks. Keep going. Jump out, jump in. Jump out, jump in. Turn around the other way. Oh boy, we're looking good. Do you feel great today? That's because I do. I actually feel awesome every time water is surrounding me. I'm not even kidding. I am obsessed. And a pulsing squat. Plie and pulse. Ta-dam, ta-dam. You can keep your feet grounded or you can move your heels up. And you can also alternate, right? Heel, then left heel. Play a little bit with the water, moving arms front and back. Allow those hips to open up. Allow those muscles to stretch out. Should I be quiet a little bit so we can enjoy the music? Okay, I'll, I'm just going to give you a moment here. Keep pulsing. Belly in. Sorry. I had to. Shake your head a little bit. Woohoo! Yes. Are those shoulders already deep down in the water? Wet? Comfortable with this temperature? Make sure they do. Dip it down, dip it down. Come on, come on. What are you waiting for? <laughs> Wide knee tucks. We're going to keep those feet open and we're going to tuck knees up and down. Just like that. Use your arms to make those jab jumps a little more funky. Uh-huh. Shake it a little bit if you still can coordinate all of this craziness into one exercise. Keep going, keep tucking, ta-dum, ta-dum. This one is waking up our six-pack. It may be asleep, so let's wake it up. Woo! All right. Let's now do twist to the knee. We're going to kind of move knee out to the side and drag our opposite arm in a direction of the knee. So this is low impact twist because we have one foot grounded on the bottom, at least for a moment. Keep your hands in the water to feel that additional resistance because guess what? This is a quick warm up and we have to start getting used to pushing our body through and against the resistance. We're gonna do single knee, single knee, and then double. Oh yeah. And again, single, single, double, double. Yep, switch things up, make it a little more fun, dancey, shake your booty a little bit, why not? Come on, come on, do it for me. Shake, shake, shake. <laughs> if you're in a bigger group, look around, see who's shaking in a best style today. Yeah, feel free to move around a tiny bit here. Anytime we add movement to the same exercise, we are burning more calories. Single, single, double, double. Single, single, double, double. Yep, get used to me and know you for the next hour, friends. Round one. Alternate back toe taps. This is our intro exercise. And then we're gonna have sideways run and on the way back, sideways scissors. But let's focus on those taps. You're gonna push your toe back and extend arms forward. And then you're gonna switch leg and do the same. 
and this is looking good and this feels even better one foot grounded on the bottom the other one moves away scoop this water and push it forward no equipment doesn't mean that we really don't use any equipment guys this water that surrounds you is our equipment for today how's that everything you do in a water it's 12 ha times harder than if you were doing this on land plus once we start adding equipment day two and three and on it's even more tricky here we are sideways run get ready to them to them crossing those feet over let's say eight to ten depending how much space you have and then floating you are coming back with scissors and this one is tricky i need you do your best we'll begin with run to the right side here we go ta dum ta dum pushing the water away okay yes in the opposite direction that our run and now dealing with the floatiness i don't know use your arms in any way to stay afloat do your best non-swimmers you can always wear aqua belt this will still qualify as no equipment because aqua belt will just support you in the floating position guys we enjoyed this side for three minutes so do your best i'll let you know when it's time to switch side and repeat the same amazingness on the other side let's go music please Let's return to alternate back toe taps for just 30 seconds, just to catch the breath and focus on a little bit deeper breathing. Yeah, kind of like a recover. It's our transitional exercise. We will be back to this challenging segment that you've just experienced. So sideways run, my friend, left side, and then come back with sideways scissors. Enjoy it, three minutes music back on and you just remember to do your absolutely best oh yeah
Final seconds, my friends, for this round one to be completed. Keep on going. You can now choose to stop by for a quick water break. And meanwhile, I will be showing you what's next. It's very important that you drink plenty of water during this workout and definitely after. And round two, we guys now gonna move backwards and forward. Now you're gonna have two options of how you're gonna move forward. Backwards, we just run, okay? Keep your feet close to the bottom of the pool. Now heading forward, you can choose to swim. If you are a swimmer, choose your favorite style. If you're non-swimmer, watch me because I'm gonna show you other version of how you can complete this round. You can look, tuck those knees up and jump forward, okay? So that's gonna be your number two, watch me again. Heading back, splash and drag the water forward. And look, I am hopping back towards you, tucking those knees. This works your abs, this works your arms, and it's actually very similar to that swim style that I like the most. Great exercise. Each way you work different muscle groups, heading backward, mostly back and postural muscles, um, hamstrings, everything else on the backside of your body. Hopping forward, you know, quads, chest, abs, it is happening. And guys, depending how much energy you brought to today's workout, you can move to, you can choose to move extremely fast or you can just kind of go with the medium tempo. If you imagine scale one to 10, where 10 is insanely fast, as long as you are in between seven to nine, I am super proud of you. You are burning body fat. You are keeping the heart rate up and that's what we want for this day one, okay? Lots of cardio, kind of waking up into this seven day challenge. I'm swimming, I love to swim. <laughs> How about you guys? What style are you gonna choose? You can even jump with your head under the water. Why not? Do we have any lap swimmers in aqua? I bet we do. So go for it. This is your style heading forward. Music back on. And we guys enjoy it. Let's do. Uh-huh.
and final seconds again make sure you really finish up this round in style still putting your absolutely best energy and then again maybe head for a quick water break because next round i'm warning you it's gonna be pretty fast and is this what we need Woohoo! it's a perfect day today day one to really bring that energy and use it in the pool i love to float a little bit relax for a second or 30 seconds maybe <laughs> sip of water catch the breath round three aqua sprint we're gonna spin around and then unspin with cross country skiing three minutes ladies and gentlemen look at those arms we're gonna circle them around you want to see the water motion you want to see how the water is splash is bubbly you can hear it i am doing my absolutely best and i need the same commitment from you so make sure those legs are moving super super fast arms are following up and now watch here's cross country skiing you will be turning the other way around on your spot it's a speedy version of cross country. You don't have any equipment, so just drag those palms back. If there was a wall behind you, you kind of want to give fives to the wall, high fives, actually low fives in this case. Don't bend forward. Use your core strength and action, go. Aqua sprint, turn to your right. You're gonna follow your right shoulder. Oh my, oh my, it's super, super challenging, is it? Yes, cross country action all the way around this way you won't get dizzy this is a total body workout i know you're feeling it right now and here's aqua sprint happening all over and all around oh my are you maintaining the same great tempo back to cross-country skiing Try bring those fingertips as close to the surface as possible. One forward, one behind. This is called effective workout. Keep on going. Aqua sprint. Keep moving those knees up, 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 up. And enjoy, please. all right and the next three minutes we guys repeat exactly the same but we're gonna now turn around to the other side yes ready oh yeah here we go figure out where the other side is go 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 you got the same aqua sprint back to super fast tempo where you feel you're doing your best it's okay if you are out of breath for a little bit couple seconds Cross-country skiing is the exercise that's going to spin you all the way around. It is like dancing, my friends. The music is great. You have to admit it. Come on. Yes, it is great. And then your workout will be amazing. Here we go. Scoop the water in towards yourself. Remind yourself now and as often as you have to. Why are you doing it? Why is it important for you to lose extra body fat, that weight? Your life will be so much better. All we need is the commitment for seven days. You can then take a day off and come back to seven more. 
and hopefully more and more. The goal is to do it four times at least to see amazing results. And as I mentioned already, these are long lasting results, but you have to do your best. It's hard work. Sometimes we guys are fooled by false commercials, lose, I don't know, 30 pounds in a month. These are not healthy ideas, okay? Our body needs to lose weight gradually through the proper calorie intake, right? You have to eat less and burn more. It's, it's taking time, but then you can enjoy long lasting results. And your fitness level will really jump up. That's important too. That's like the best side effect ever. Come on, keep moving, keep moving, speed it up, speed it up. This is a tempo where singing along would not be possible or in a best case scenario, your singing sounds horrible. Like, oh, that's the tempo I need for you right now. Turn the other way around. Looking good, my friends. Yes, final seconds. Final, final seconds. Don't slow down yet. Keep going, keep going. Finish it up, finish it up. Cross country skiing, couple more times. And yes, oh yeah, we finished next round and we are ready for number four. Shake it a little bit for me, come on. Jump for joy, who's gonna jump higher? Do it, woohoo, awesome. Round four is here, speedy aqua jacks with aqua sprint. What? Sprints again? Well, why not? Firstly, give those arms a little break, okay? Firstly, then look push those fists forward punch like there's no tomorrow and experience the awesome lymphatic aqua massage here are your speedy jacks leave your arms alone please you're gonna do so much better with just legs and uh, i don't know i hate to mention that but i'm gonna torture your arms tomorrow day two it's all about arm strength here we go aqua jacks how fast can you beat me with that tempo? Come on, come on. Oh yeah, aqua sprint. Chop, 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 chop. Push those hands through the wall of water. Curl those knees up. Aqua jacks again. Each time you are faster. Ha uh ha. -huh. And aqua sprint, love it. Do you like the music? All right, then go with the flow. In and out. Remember, it's not just your legs. Yes, priority is for lower body, inner thighs, out thighs. Really, these muscles we really complain about. But complaining does nothing. We have to do something about it. So here we go, jumping, jacking back, sprinting forward. Oh yeah. This is espresso sprint. Jacks again. No breaks between. You wanna take less than half of a second to transition from one exercise to another one. I'm not gonna wait for you. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do more. I'm going so fast that I'm losing my shoes. That, that's happening. If this happens to you, it's probably because you're doing amazing. Yeah, if you lose your shoe, Sometimes the bottom of your swimsuit, it's probably because you are doing absolutely best. <laughs> By the way, I hope you are wearing one piece suit because there's a little bit of jumping later on. <laughs> yeah, so just remember, day one, one piece suit, no equipment, aqua shoes recommended. <laughs> okay, did you guys notice that little transition? I'm pressing on my palms now. Yeah, I'm building muscles. So here, moving backwards this time, um, punching, and now press, squeeze those palms together, and let's firm up chest. Still jumping jacks happening, you can see me, right? Oh my goodness, my shoes cannot handle that tempo. <laughs> Aqua jacks, I'm pressing on my palms, pressing one against the other one. Oh boy, do you feel that burn in your chest? 
Yes, it's your fat screaming, screaming, sweating. That's why we do it. Keep on going, guys. Enjoy, enjoy music louder, please. Sing along. Even if it sounds ugly, don't worry. All right, I'm coming back. I'm pushing it hard, and guess what? I'm checking on you right now. How are you doing? I can see you. Okay, let me put my shades off. <laughs> I see you guys. Do your best. <laughs> Final seconds. We are getting there. We're soon gonna be halfway through. Look what I'm doing. I'm dragging my hands behind this time. Yeah, this tricep is on fire. Ooh, don't slow down yet. Almost, almost. I love adding motion to all those exercises. Feels good. Feels good to be done and ready for round five. You take a quick water break. Very important. And I will show you what's next. Round five. We're gonna kick forward. These are power front kicks and then it's even better. We're gonna do swing kicks. So kicks and kicks, no mercy. Let's start with left leg. Get ready. You're gonna enjoy it for six minutes. Oh yeah. If you need to stop and relax for a moment between, fine. Other than this, we want three minutes per side, okay? Firstly, left. Kick like there's no tomorrow. I'll let you know when we switch exercise. Usually it's gonna be 30 seconds and 30 seconds, okay? Swing kicks and power kicks. Turn around toward the front so I can see you, so you can see me. So we can match our tempo. Aye. Yep. Can you kick above the surface for me? All right. Yep, once and twice. Do it again. Swing kicks. Now you're going to alternate your legs. Your toes are pointed. You're dragging your hands back. If there was a wall behind you, you are pushing your hands back to the wall. Notice that these kicks are much lower. You're going to feel the fire in your quads. Muscle that starts right above your knee. Okay. This muscle is big. It's a muscle group. It's going to burn calories when you sleep. Let's go, left kick. Again? Uh-huh. I told you, it's not gonna be easy. We gotta work for those results. Leg that's standing on the ground is grounded. Try to keep it as close to the surface as possible. I decided to take my shoes off with this one because I know I would be losing my shoe. Yeah, sometimes the color is more important to me than the right size, and this is how I'm ending up, losing my shoes. Here we go, Sw swing kicks. Turn, turn around. Sing along, my friends. Don't worry if you sound like a broken record, it's fine. That's how challenging aqua singing sounds like. Come on, still doing best or we are not at the same page <laughs> awesome job let's do more kick touch back right after each kick your foot is touching the floor every single time this one is super challenging i hate doing kicks like this on land Water is so much more appropriate for kicks. And it's more effective too. Are you still using those hands? Come on, guys. Come on. Drag that water behind you. 
and swing kicks happening again. Are you doing your best? Because I am. And I hate to be alone on this journey. Kick a little harder. Come on. Push. Couple more swing kicks and we will be switching to the other side so really what's gonna be different now your kicks now go to other leg so you kick with your right same great energy tough kicks and then you are excused from doing crunches or most importantly from doing the dishes yes you have to save your best energy for day two for arms so if you share your space with someone explain no me doing dishes today tomorrow sorry i'm on that seven day plan here we go swing kicks ha 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 they can join us they can have the same excuse no problem Swing, 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 push it hard. Oh, those results. And kicks. Let's go. Right leg. Oh, yeah. I like to imagine that I want to break through some doors, and every single kick should destroy these doors is that what's helping you uh-huh maybe let's do swing kicks and let's spin around you're never gonna find me staying and facing the same side for too long friends it's summer it's sunshine and i need an even tan and you do as well <laughs> eyeglasses and hats definitely important to protect from that excess of the sun we have final seconds going on the water is super splashy ouch what a break this is a perfect timing and good opportunity for me to show you what's next give me that lovely jump come on guys oh look at me Woo how's your jump turning out <laughs> Round six, we'll have skib B and jumps, tucking knees. Oh yes, let's now focus on back side of our body. Why not? Begin slowly, just curling your heels back and consider this version. If for any reason you need to go slower, maybe you had knee surgery, maybe skib B is uncomfortable, no problem, you can do it in low impact and your knees will appreciate. Other than this, this is the actual skip B plus, yes, we're gonna add arms. We will be splashing water out. Ready, go, ha <laughs> ha. Shake your head a little bit to admit, I'm right again. Move forward, skip B. Uh-huh, uh-huh, getting closer, getting closer and hop it on your way back scoop it my friends haha -ha. feel weightless 
Awesome. Good, good ab workout. And again, heading forward, heels back. Do you feel those back muscles in action? Oh yeah. Hop back, scoop it, scoop it. Scoop it like it's your favorite ice cream. What's your favorite ice cream, by the way? Oh, I'm the worst. I know, I know, we're trying to lose weight here. And am I talking about ice cream? Oh, I'm sorry. Nah, it's okay to have favorite food. Obviously, ice creams are amazing. I would dare to say if you love aqua, you probably like ice creams. <laughs> My favorite passion fruit ice cream and passion fruit in general and fruits in general. So, are you guys on a great way to lose weight? And it doesn't mean that we have to refuse our favorite snacks. Not at all. Life is too short to skip ice creams. <laughs> It's important that we work out hard and then enjoy healthy food 99% of the time and then have that sweet tooth for something amazing. I know I'm the worst, but you know, I want you guys to live a great life, happy life, and always think about not diet as period of time where you have to you know be miserable and hate your life and hate the fact that you're on a diet no diet is how you live and our life is supposed to be filled with amazing food that God placed on earth for us uh, talking about ice creams I don't know if you got actually made ice creams but yeah but we did and we can surely enjoy them from time to time other than this fruits veggies and healthy healthy choices <laughs> anytime i do those knee tuck jumps i feel like i'm 12. <laughs> all right i'm gonna watch you again turning towards you uh-huh how about if we try turn around now and then unspin see how that goes Curious? Well, let's do it. Skip B, spinning around on a spot. I kind of like it. And then hopping, scooping as we reverse. And this is amazing. I guess we're gonna do it again and again. We've been already splashing for 40 minutes and we guys are very close to an end so if you feel like you have still a little bit of that great energy this is the time of using it other way around of course you know what's tricky our body waits with uh, burning with using energy from body fat a little bit longer usually it waits about 30 minutes so yeah i mean that's the sad truth that we burn uh, we take energy from other sources first and we have to keep going and keep going and then finally our body burns fat so that's what's happening right now as we speak good okay final seconds and we're gonna move on maybe maybe just maybe take a quick water break and then more splash and more fun. Oh yeah. Catch a breath, inhale deeply into the nose, exhale out through your mouth. Water, water, water. And round seven is already waiting for you. Front kick, side kick with touchdowns. And then we're gonna run forward and backwards, just one step. So take a moment to watch me how it goes. Here's front kick, touch down, back kick, touch down, switch leg, uh-huh. So we do both sides, that's why we have a little more time. Guys, again, these are tough kicks, okay? Like the front kick repeaters that we had going on before. Now you mix it, front, push down, side, and down, flex your foot. Kick as close to the water surface as possible, 
Please use those arms. What are you waiting for? Come on. Keep going. These are tough kicks. These are results producing kicks. And as you know, we'll just have 15 minutes left. So no excuses, my friends. Uh -uh. Like we had any excuses in the first place. <laughs> Now, those of you who picked this challenge, you know why. And I know you're going to complete it and enjoy very, very good results. And they are yours for as long as you are subscribed to this platform. And I want you guys to take advantage of it and enjoy it. Keep going still kicking putting the best energy all right now watch me doing next exercise run forward run back it's the same leg that takes you front front and back back you're gonna use your arms to drag your body through the wall of water faster stay on the same two spots front front back back it's not that much about curling knees up and down anymore you need to balance between two spots so if somebody was watching you from the outside they need to see that your body moves front and back don't allow the step to be too tiny and look like you are just skipping because sometimes i'm sending my private planes to your backyards to your swimming pools and if you see the plane passing through the sky above you it may be just me and now I want to see you kicking again front touch down and back touch down awesome do it again uh-huh don't forget to incorporate arms total body challenge you're gonna feel great when you finish. Switch leg, run, run. Left, left, back, back. Front, front, back, back. I honestly feel like power super woman when I do this one. Keep on going. And back to kicks because we need a little bit more of that challenge. Here we go. Resume your kicks. And again, run, run, front, front, back, back. More of this is happening. Plus, we are now turning around. Why not? get that even tan look around who's in a pool today are you sharing pool with others or are you lucky to be on your own i don't know if that's lucky depending who you share pool with right <laughs> i would say the worst type of people that you have to share the pool with are those who are standing like too close to you even, even if the entire pool is available if it's crowded it's crowded but if it's available come on you guys give others a space <laughs> i hope i didn't step on someone's toe now <laughs> we are kicking again oh yes and look what's happening now guys we're gonna add additional challenge to our kicks but you're gonna clearly see with the underwater camera in a moment we now have kick and then corner kick with both legs does this sound like fun or challenging fun i guess a little bit of each right so here we go front kick touch down corner kick ouch front kick touch down my friends kick to the corner and use those arms to balance to float i'm telling you lower abs are screaming for mercy now music on 
and we are running again front front back back turn around have fun Oh my good stuff. We guys have two rounds left. Awesome. Round eight. Cross country skiing and then knee repeaters. Knee repeaters is low impact. Cross country kind of. Right? We're not gonna jump up and down too much. We're only gonna enjoy this round for three minutes. Those last two are pretty fast. And let's move arms front and back just like that. Core engage. Stay in line, keep your toes pointed forward, keep your knees slightly bent, and voila, magic is happening. Feel free to turn around one way and then another way. Move around. If you work out with somebody else, you can guys be switching spots. But most importantly, keep that heart rate up. It feels amazing to be able to do all of this. Only six months ago, I had a surgery and just the fact that I can do all of this in the water with you guys is amazing. Knee repeaters. This taught me so much. I have so much respect for my body, for what I put to my body, for all the little pleasures that we should offer to ourselves, for the fact that if we want to take care of others, we have to take care of ourselves first. Otherwise, we may not be able to do it. Cross-country skiing. So just the fact that you decided to take this journey with me means that we are on the same page. Yeah, we understand that this body given to us should last us many, many years. But how many? We have a huge control over that. Not 100% control, but definitely we can decide what we are putting our body through. Knee repeaters again, other leg. Make it challenging, guys. Yeah. Come on. And back to cross-country skiing. Keep on going, keep on going. We are turning around. Look at your surroundings. Is it a beautiful fresh air around you? Or just a fancy pool? Or just a pool? <laughs> Final seconds for this segment. Shake it a little bit for me. Come on, come on, don't be shy. Uh-huh. Shake some more. This is round nine. Knee curls aside. Yeah, we're going to focus on the waist. Uh-huh. You ready? Go. So now instead of curling knees front and back, you go to the side and then your toe must get back down to the floor. 
all the way towards your knee, scoop that water, kind of like you try to splash on your knee or behind your knee. Awesome, awesome abdominal exercise. Yes, crunches are boring. This is what's gonna make you up stronger. Plus, look, we got starfish. So you are floating, kicking your legs back and your arms forward. Oh yeah, it's kind of like donkey kicks, but you can go ahead and lie down on the surface of the water. Do we look awesome or what? <laughs> other side. Yeah, let's make sure we look amazing. Finish up the other side, knee repeaters. Oh yes. Keep going, come on. Come on, we're getting there. Okay, how your final five minutes of this workout will be. And here's Starfish. Do it. Enjoy it. If you are not enjoying Starfish, I don't know. There must be something wrong with you. I feel like I'm six when I do it. And knee repeaters again. Now I'm back to 12. <laughs> Keep going. Knee curls. Yes. And yes again. Come on. Scoop the water towards you. What other ways you can add? What can you add to this exercise to be more challenged? Or make your starfish exercise more fun? Do you want to do silly face each time? Come on, do it. Working out is like a celebration of health or life in general. It's okay if you are silly. It's okay when you laugh. Yeah, you can fool around a little bit. It's not a waste of time. Look at me, look at me. I'm just kicking and pushing arms forward. I'm floating. Yeah, that really feels like being what a creature. Round 10, twists into the knee plus power jumps. Now, yeah, I left the best for the end. So now my friends twisting into the knee yeah, kind of like Elvis twist. Moving around the pool, splashing the water around. Can you splash the water, please? Come on. I know we can barely move. It was such a long workout, guys. Can you splash every other twist? Every third. Okay, deal, every fourth. I hope you guys enjoy this journey and I hope you have a beautiful day today. I'm not done with you yet. Here we have jumps, knee tucks. This is one way to do it. And another way, which I will show you in a moment, we're gonna jump up to the sky. And this is why right here you need one piece suit. Or how to say that, you may be in trouble. <laughs> Keep jumping, keep jumping, keep jumping. Do you guys want to know something super funny? I'm going to tell you something funny at the end because you've been working out with me so long. I'm from Poland. If you go to Poland to the swimming pools, you guys, talking to guys, are not allowed to have shorts. You need to have speedos. Yes, shorts are not allowed. Please don't tell me why. I won't explain. I don't know. I'm I'm just freaking out about it. My son don't want to go to the swimming pool with me for this reason. All I can do is just jump for joy now and just pretend that it's okay. <laughs> I know each country has something super crazy uh, going on. <laughs> but that's okay. It's okay. I'm just telling you that in case you one day decide to visit my lovely country and do aqua workouts there. Don't say I didn't warn you. Get your speedos with you when you go to Poland. Final jumps. I'm out of breath. How about you? Come on, be out of breath. Jump. 
jump oh higher and the highest one now awesome awesome couple more knee tucks if you wish these are really final seconds and guess what you've completed one of the hardest workouts ever <laughs> and this is just day one ha <laughs> ha cool down is coming your way next so it's time to take a quick water break and five minutes to relax to cool down to round up that spine just like that feels so good And then slowly bring your heels down. Push your tailbone back and arch that spine a little bit. Feet grounded. Hold that pose and breathe through it. Look up, lift up your chest. And then we're gonna be tapping toes back just this time. Start pressing your heels closer and closer toward the ground. Don't drag your body against the flow. Now go with the flow. This is what cool down is about. Giving our body heads up. We are done. Thank you for doing all of those moves with me, talking to the body. And now relax, step it out. Again, hands are just swinging and floating on the surface. Be relaxed. Coordinate your breath with the tempo, which is getting slower and slower. Add a little bit of the rotation moves. Just push your body almost like you'd be, I don't know, completely relaxed. Please. Move your heels up, open up those heels, open up those hips. Read the motivation of the day. The distance between your dreams and reality is called action, my friends. We cannot expect different results if we don't change something about our body, about our life, about our behavior. Start pushing your heel back and down to the ground. And then again, other side. Relax those wrists and muscles surrounding it. We want the entire body to feel the challenge, but then absorb to the challenge in the right way so we could be ready for tomorrow. There's so much more tomorrow, I'm excited. Don't miss it. I need you to do all seven days and then if necessary, take one day off, but don't skip them. Make a commitment, round up your spine and move with the water like a wave. Relax, feel the flexible body of yours. One more time, thank you so much for joining me today. See you tomorrow.